there are two main reasons why employers should pay attention to social well-being. And the first is because if you look at all of the factors that most predict what engages employees at work and what makes them want to come into work, by far and away the biggest predictor is the relationship that people have with their peers, most specifically with their line manager, but definitely with their peers and the network of people that they have around them. So it is an incredibly motivating, flip the du duvet off type of a reason for why people come into work. The second reason is because actually it's an incredibly strong moderator. So if you look at the factors that things like stress or issues with low pay and all other sorts of negative issues, if you like, that people may have to cope with at work, if they've got strong social well-being, if they've got a strong network and peer group that they enjoy coming to work with, then actually the research shows that that's a really strong predictor of them not necessarily being as negatively affected by the negative influences that they may face at work. So not only is it a positive influencer, it also helps deal with the negative things that they may find at work as well. Mm -hmm.